All right, so overnight it is charged up to 29.4 and now it's making a little clicking noise. Uh, that little solid state relay, that big black box right there, I believe is where the clicking is coming from, which just means that this char solar charge controller is opening and shutting or, you know, so it's, it's pulsating very, very slowly, letting voltage in. I assume to compensate for the BMS and this guy running. Just topping it off a bit. It's uh, it's pretty good. I just checked their... Uh, let's see if I can do this quickly. So, 4 4.19, 4.18, 4.235, 4.25, 4.21, 4 4.23, 4.2. So they're all pretty well balanced. So this guy is doing his job, which is good. So let's see. We're still getting very high voltage off of these lines. 80 volts. See when there's no load, 80 volts. And when there's no load, 32. It's all over the place because of the paint. 36. 36 volts when it's not on load on the heat sink. Pretty safe, eh? Pretty safe. So, yeah, it's, um, neat let's see I'm gonna go off of these two for the solar panel 36.5 yeah so yeah it's I'm getting down there I've got a lot of little guys so I'll have to build I could probably build another wall just with bad batteries and because it's parallel with this one they act independently when the BMS is hooked up so you can have one wall of really crappy batteries one of really good ones and as you get more good batteries, you can, you know, get enough and then swap out the whole unit. So yeah, if anyone lives in Ontario and wants to buy some low-end batteries for some kind of product, project, let me know. Maybe just for fun, I can sell them for pretty cheap. I'd, I'm probably going to tear up all these and test them. I need to get a little... Um, soldering kit or whatever it's called a little welding kit but yeah so I've, I've proven I left it overnight I didn't die there was a ton of heat coming off these heat sinks though so a fan would be needed but other than that everything went very well I'm pretty happy with it so yeah I just thought I'd uh, just do a quick update just to verify that it does in fact go to 29.4 and stay there which is very very good and these guys they didn't do anything crazy there's no heat no heat buildup I can use this simple little heat gun to uh, verify that in the future though it would be nice to get a visual one that would be a lot easier to test since you could just see but anyways, thanks guys. Bye.